Hello my beautiful piña babes and welcome back to my channel. I hope that you guys are having a wonderful day, but most importantly, happy new year. You guys, I cannot believe that we are officially already in 2022 and I hope that this year brings nothing but happiness into your life and that you guys are staying safe and healthy. I'm pretty sure you guys are wondering where the heck I have been. There's a whole video coming up in regards to that, but today's video, you guys, I want to go ahead and jump straight in. We are going to be diving in into Ioni makeup. If you are unfamiliar with Ioni, they're pretty much, oh, not almost everywhere, but at least almost in all 99 cent stores and Dollar Tree, they do have some of my personal favorite lashes. And for a dollar, I mean, come on. For example, these right here, we're going to be trying these on. I'm not sure if they have more things included in their line, but for my Dollar Tree, this was the only things that I was able to pick up. So we are going to be testing out this tinted lip balm. I mean, hello, can we talk about the packaging? The packaging is beautiful so this is the tinted lip balm right here this is in the shade warm nude we also have a highlighter in the shade golden glow a brow gel you guys this was the only shade they had which is dark brown they also have a face finishing spray I'm so excited to try this out we also have a hydrating face primer a liquid felt tip eyeliner and last but not least a pencil eyeliner this is in the shade black so if you are new here around these neck of the woods make sure to subscribe down below by hitting that red button and make sure to turn on that notification bell so that way you are notified of all of my future uploads so you guys already know the drill with my grip it or skip it but if you don't let me go ahead and reintroduce you on my grip it or skip it videos i like to pretty much try on for the first time any product and let you know whether it's worth it or not so if it's a grip it that means go ahead and run and go get it skip it don't even bother wasting your coins so with no further ado let's go ahead and jump right into the video To keep this video organized, we're going to go ahead and try on the things and the way that I like to do my makeup first. So you guys already know that I love to start with brows. They're pretty much already done, but since they don't have like a eyeliner, I'm sorry, not an eyeliner, a eyebrow pencil or eyebrow pomade, I just went ahead and did them myself. So we're going to go ahead and take the brow gel first to test this out. Again, this is in the shade dark brown. Oh, okay. This is nice. I thought, so this is the color of it. Okay. Pretty interesting. I thought that the brown was actually just the color of the glass the packaging but it's actually the actual pomade and this is what it looks like please excuse my nails i know they're mm, girl i know so we're just gonna go ahead and put this on okay this is what the wand looks like i kind of want to see the color first oh it's a very dark chocolatey brown if you can see right here nice 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 i guess i mean my the, my brows are already dark let me just go ahead and put my hair out of my face i hope that you guys are well my voice sounds a little raspy you guys because i'm getting better from a cold that i had a long story but let's see oh i'm so scared that this might change the color oh my god First of all, let me put some back into here because it's very brown. And I just needed to hold my brows in place, you know? I'm not sure if they do carry other colors because this was the only one that my Dollar Tree had. I hope they do because I need a like a black one. 
it does give you a tint there is a brown tint there like see now i have brown and black eyebrows okay whatever we're going with the flow i mean as long as they stay in place right next we're gonna go in with our face primer this is the hydrating version again not sure if they have different finishes but we're gonna go ahead and try this out it's so cute oh i thought it was gonna be like watery doesn't it look like one of those little barbie toys i don't know i think it's so adorable but this is what is looking like very very cute love that oh it's very jelly like oh wow you do have to squeeze real hard to get the product out it's very 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 thick i'm not sure if you guys are gonna be able to see how like thick that is like oh it's definitely one of those like silicone base products i don't mind silicone because i feel like it does help out smooth out my pores so if you have large pores this will definitely help it smooth it out it's not sticky it's just very silicone-y is it hydrating i personally don't feel the hydration but we shall see it did smooth my pores a bit but i just don't feel again the hydration my eyebrows are like throwing me off because of the brown tint we're just gonna leave it like that they don't have a foundation or concealer or powder or any of that good stuff so what i'm gonna go ahead and do is just finish the rest of my face and come back to a product that they do have so that way we can go ahead and test it out so i'll be right back perfect guys we are back i went ahead and pretty much did pretty much most of my face the only thing that we are missing is highlighter the lips and of course eyelashes and the eyeliner so we're gonna go ahead and go in with the liquid felt tip eyeliner hopefully this is good you guys the packaging of all of these products are actually very unique in my opinion this is what the eyeliner looks like i'm so excited to try it hopefully it's matte Oh my god sorry my hands are slippery or this just doesn't want to come out <laughs> oh my god are you serious oh my god it doesn't want to open okay let that kind of sit there we're gonna go ahead and move on to the pencil eyeliner again this is in the shade black we're just going to go ahead and do the bottom on the waterline first. Very nice. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, you're going to have to self-sharpen it. But it's kind of heavy, low-key. This is what it looks like. And we're just going to go ahead and just go with it. Let's see. It's very creamy. And it's very dark, too. Well, I like that. I like that. Let me see. It's very, very black, you guys. And it's super, super creamy. Love this. Let's see if we can... Ah, yay! I was able to open the liquid eyeliner, so... Oh, my God. I don't want to judge it right off the bat, but I have a feeling I'm not going to like this. And it's only because of the applicator. But this is what the applicator looks like. I don't know how to explain it, but it's just one of those applicators that it... I like my applicator to move, you know? Like one of those soft applicators. This one is pretty tough. I mean, it's pigmented, but and let's, let's go with it. I mean, I mean, 
<laughs> For a dollar twenty five now because Dollar Tree is now a dollar twenty five. It does the job, but it's hmm. We'll see, we'll see. The next product that I'm really excited to try, and it's only because it looks very beautiful, it is their highlight. Again, this is in the shade Golden Glow. And packaging would have been very cute, but because the packaging comes already like this, it's kind of like hard to close. But this is cute, very small and convenient. You guys know I love small things when it comes to makeup. So let's go ahead and just take a highlighting brush. I kind of want to swatch it on my hand first. Oh, okay. Do you guys see that? Let's put it on our face. <laughs> it does feel a little bit powdery to the touch, but whoa. Hold on, guys. Maybe I did put a little too much. I like how it glows, but it's very glittery. Now we're gonna go in with lashes, you guys. We have the Ioni 3D Fold Mink Lashes. This is in the style Wispy Full Dramatic. They look absolutely beautiful. What I love about these lashes as well, I think I already mentioned it, is that they are handmade and they have a lot of styles you guys it just depends on your dollar tree or your 99 cent store because trust me i've had luck and not good luck trying to find these so if you find them girl pick them up what's so funny is that i forgot my mascara so i don't know how that's gonna work out but i know for a fact these lashes are bomb af while we let the eyelash glue kind of do its thing, I'm just going to go ahead and spray my face with the face finishing spray. I love the color of this. Okay, I was going to say, is this liquidy because the primer? Mm -mm. So this is what it looks like. So cute. I'm just going to go ahead and spray it. Let me see. What's the spray like? Oh, we got to be careful. doesn't smell that bad but it does have like a very like boom in your face spray so we're gonna be careful let's spray it very far away actually oh i'm so scared but here we go mm. So lashes are now on, you guys. I absolutely love how they complement this look. That's for sure. Like I said, I've tried Ioni lashes way before, so I know for a fact how bomb they are. Last but not least, we do have this tinted lip balm in the shade Warm Nude. The color itself, it's very, very pretty. Like, I love this. Oh, okay. This is what the applicator looks like. It smells like something. Uh, hmm. mm. No. Sorry. No, no, no. Let me go ahead and just finish the rest of my face, which is just the lips. And then I will be back with my final thoughts. So here is the final look, you guys, using some of Ioni Cosmetics um what did you guys think and be honest let me know in the comments down below but let's get into the skip it for me let me start off with this face hydrating primer i do not like it 
I feel like I'm not sure if the camera is picking it up, but it kind of lifted my bronzer on my forehead, on my forehead, on my forehead. So I'm not sure if perhaps I used a little too much. And it's also kind of picking up here on my nose. So I'm not sure how I feel about that. Maybe I did use a little too much, but at least on my forehead, I can like this area right here it's spotchy if that's the word is it spotchy or spotty splotty i'm not sure but it's it's one of those and i'm not feeling it at all the consistency of it too like like you see like i can't even get it out this way unless i squeeze so hard and even then it still doesn't come out so i have to literally open it I don't know if you guys can kind of see the inside like it's just very jelly like and for my liking for a hydrating primer it has to be rich it has to be creamy this is just not it for me so going for the face hydrating primer it's definitely a skip it another product that i just feel like it's a skip it for me it is the felt tip eyeliner i do not like it i felt like yes it does its job if you're in a hurry and you just need an eyeliner to go then okay grab it but it's not my favorite and it's because of the application and as i was putting it on and trying to go over it it was cracking it's not my cup of tea so with the eyeliner the liquid eyeliner it's a skip it as well another skip it for me it is their face spray it's just too like too aggressive like come on if only if it was a fine mist then perhaps i would like it i don't know why i'm getting lavender vibes and i don't know it's just too aggressive for me you guys and if you're doing some bomb ass makeup and then you just spray this on top it's going to be a disaster so not my cup of tea the next product that is also a skip it for me it is their brow gel and i feel like i'm only doing the skip it for this because of the color i wish they had a dark color a darker color than this perhaps a black then maybe it would have been different but i right now i could tell like that i have the brown tint like if you come close to me you could tell that there's brown in here and i'm not the type that's gonna go outside with black and brown with black and brown brows that's just not me if they had it in black then maybe i would give it a try but it's just the color, it's, it's not me. The last product that I'm gonna go ahead and do a skip it, it is their tinted lip balm. The packaging is beautiful. I love this applicator, but the color for my skin tone, it just was not it. The formula though, as I put it on and you guys saw that I wiped it right off, it was very smooth, very creamy a little bit of hydration i felt it but i think they should just make different colors like it's 2022 cosmetic lines there's more than just fair and light and medium we have a lot of skin tones so i feel like we all deserve a shade and this just wasn't my shade the two products though that were definitely a grip it for me was definitely their eyeliner it is so creamy it went on so smooth and it's literally like pitch black and i love that in an eyeliner like i don't want it to be light black medium black like it needs to be black as it can be and it's so beautiful like it applied so creamy so fast and so smooth so this is definitely definitely a grip it for me gonna definitely continue using it now this one i was very hesitant at first but i know you guys see that glow and definitely definitely a grip it for me 
only because of course you already know that i am that i love to glow bitch like yes honey you see that you see that i know you see it from across the street i know my alien friends up there they see it too and i totally totally love it once i sprayed it a little bit with their setting spray i did notice that it blended into my skin very beautifully so it wasn't as glittery as it is when you first apply it so just beware that it does feel very powdery at first when you touch it and when you apply it but i feel like once you spray your face to pretty much complete it it just melts right into it and it gives you that most beautiful glow and for a dollar 25 it's definitely a grip it for me so that is it my beautiful piña babes i hope that you enjoyed this video be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and let me know in the comments down below what ioni products you have tried of course before i forget bitch how can i forget these lashes but you already know they're a gripper for me i have so many ioni style lashes in my collection that of course it's go get it if you see them in your 99 cent store in your dollar tree grab them while you can and yeah let me know in the comments down below my beautiful piña babes what products you have tried already or what products are you curious to try and make sure to subscribe to my channel before leaving if you have not already and make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and turn on that bell so that way you are notified every time that i upload Thank you guys again so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.